So I recently went on a hike to the Watkins Glen State Park in New York and climbed the famous Gorge Trail. This is a trail that winds up through a gorge and features many stunning waterfalls, rock formations, and steep cliffs. While planning for this adventure, one of the things I considered is which camera would be the best one to bring along to capture this stunning scenery. I wanted to capture unique footage and not just the same shots that everybody else gets here. Now, I did initially consider bringing along my drone, but I looked into it a little bit and with New York State Parks, New York does require permits in their state parks. And basically this state park, you're not going to get approved for a permit. So the drone was quickly off the table as an option. And truthfully, it really wouldn't be practical to film with a drone in this area anyway, because this hike up through the gorge is very steep. It's very narrow and winding, and there are some tunnels to go through as well. In addition, there's quite a few people and a, I don't want to disturb the experience for other people, and B, I don't like to fly my drone where there's a lot of people. So I settled on bringing along a camera that's small, light, easy to use, and most importantly, a camera that would enable me to get those unique, impossible shots. Shots that basically make it look like I brought along an entire camera crew with me. So I brought along the Insta360 X3 with the selfie stick, and boy am I glad that I did. The Insta360 X3 allowed me to capture some absolutely stunning shots on this hike up the Watkins Glen Gorge. And because this is a 360 camera, I was able to reframe those shots later on exactly the way I wanted to for my finished production. And of course, I could do this using the free Insta360 Studio app on my computer. And this app from Insta360 makes it super easy to reframe shots. Now, the Insta360 X3 was released in September 2022. So this camera is more than a year old now, but in my opinion, this is still the best 360 camera out there for the price right now. And the X3 is my favorite camera to bring along on any hiking adventure where I really want to capture those stunning impossible shots. This camera gets the job done. The 5.7K footage that this camera captures and stitches inside the camera enables me to export the finished product in 4K and that image looks really good. I also like it that even though this camera is more than a year old, Insta360 continues to release firmware updates that make this camera better and enable new settings and options in the menus. I did release a video last year with the best settings that I recommend for the Insta360 X3. Highly recommend checking that out if you own the X3 and you haven't yet. But just a quick run through of the settings that I used on this adventure. I used the normal video mode and I had the camera set to 5.7K, 24 frames per second. The bit rate was set to high. The sharpness was set to low. The white balance was set to 5,000K. The ISO was set to 1600 max. And the color mode was set to log. I set it to log because I wanted to do some grading with that footage. And I wanted to really get that look that I was going for. And the log footage from the Insta360 X3 is actually quite easy to grade. I was able to grade it rather quickly in Adobe Premiere Pro. And when reframing the footage in the Insta360 Studio app, after I did my reframing, when I went to export it, I exported it as 4K, 3840 by 2160, and I used the ProRes format. I find that with log footage, the ProRes format really preserves that quality, and I can export it in 4K and grade it later on, and I'll end up with footage that looks really good. Now, ProRes does have rather large file sizes, but ProRes is really quite easy to work with when editing. This was really an incredible hike, and I love the shots that the Insta360 X3 allowed me to capture. So if you're looking for a great 360 camera for your next adventure, I highly recommend checking out the Insta360 X3. This camera is a must have for capturing those impossible shots. I've linked to the Insta360 X3 in the description below, and I will note that Insta360 is often running promotions where you can get something free with this camera. Uh, sometimes it's the invisible selfie stick, other times it might be a different accessory. In addition, they also often have a sale on the actual price of the camera as well. And if you love to hike or go on adventures, this camera is definitely a great one to bring along.